Today we're going to go over how to set up a trigger with Bracket on TOS's Active Trader. If you haven't watched my video on how to trade options using TOS's Active Trader, please do so. I'll link it above in the top right hand corner. So with that said, let's get into it. Um, as you can see currently we're on single right here. So what that means is we just enter and then we could exit. Um, we also have OCO. So let's say you're already in a play and you want a uh, sell limit and a stop limit. You can enter those, but we're going to set up a trigger with bracket. So this gives you three options. Um, you can either set up your offset by value, um, which, for example, if I enter at three, see the value is at one and one, so we'd put it at four and two. Or you can use a tick offset, which is based solely off the ladder. Um, or you can use percentage offset, which is what I prefer. So we're going to set it up with a 10% um, stop and then 20% uh, reward right here. So let's say you also didn't want the stop in there at all. You could just unclick it from enabled and then you don't have a stop at all. And then one thing before you go any further is you're gonna wanna click right here and save it as something. So 20%, 10%, something like that then you always have this template right in here. Um, so we'll give a quick example. So what you're going to do is when you buy in here, then you don't have to do anything. You can just watch the play play out. So we'll start our on-demand feature, and we can see that our bid and ask is around 3.2. So we'll just enter there. So we're in at 3.2. Um, and then we can just watch it play out. We'll fast forward it. Um, and so whatever one of these hits first, is you'll fill out and it will cancel the other one. Um, it should should be going here soon. As you can see, we're moving up here on the chart. Um, let's say you want to move your stop up. You can move it up like that. You want to move both up. You can do it like that. Um, move your stop to break even. You're in a winning trade. Let's say you want to get filled out of it. You can move it down a little. Um, no big deal. So let's say we want to fill it 3.7. Oh, filled at 3.75. So that's a quick example of how to set up a trigger with Bracket. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Um, please consider subscribing. Thank you.